excuse my appearance y'all i learned something today okay so someone reached out to me and asked me how to fill out a notary application for the state of connecticut now i've never researched the state of connecticut before i took it as a challenge so i figured out some stuff y'all this is the application and i have never seen anything like this before in my life connecticut wants you to submit a writing sample at the very top of the application, there are four questions that they want you to answer and they want you to hand write the answer. So the individual that contacted me was having a hard time figuring out what to write for the answer. So your girl did some digging. I went online and I found the notary public handbook for the state of Connecticut. Most states have a notary handbook and you can generally find it on Google or on your secretary of state's website. So just keep that in mind. So question one asks you to write out the form for the acknowledgement for either an individual or a corporation. So if you scroll down into your notary handbook down to page 11, you'll see that they have the form for the acknowledgement. Okay, and the second question is asking about affidavits and sworn statements. And you'll find that answer on page 15 of the notary handbook. So the next question is asking about writing out the actual oath that's being administered to the notary public. That answer can be found on page seven of your notary handbook. And the last question asks to describe the ceremony for the oath and affirmation. And that is gonna be on page number 15. And the last thing it's saying that you have to do, at least on the application, is that you have to fill out the jurat on the end. Um, you'll have to get that notarized. So now you have to find a notary <laughs> to get that notarized for you. So I hope this information is very helpful to you. Um, make sure that you check and make sure that the notary handbook is up to date with your most current laws. You can also contact the secretary of state in your state and let them know that you would like a, a notary handbook. If this version that I'm pulling up online is not the updated version, you want to make sure you're up to date with that because the laws change and you want to make sure that you are in compliance. So just remember, I'm working on a series. So if there's any information that you guys would like for me to research for you, to put out there for you, let me know. You guys know I have my class. So check me out. I mean, look, y'all know that I know what I'm doing. <laughs> so, okay. Thank you guys for watching. And I really hope this information helps you. Let me know how it turns out.